Clayton, a 1 0 home win and a winning goal as well. You must be delighted. Yeah, it's good to get back to winning ways. Um, three points was, was big today. Um, a few teams dropped points on Saturday and again today, so you know, we need to try and keep in, keep in there and you know, to get the goal as well. For me, it's, uh, personally, it's a bonus, and, but I think the I think three point was, was the most important thing today. I think, you know, obviously, in playing the team down the bottom of the league, it's, it's not as easy as people think, and you know, it's going to be scrappy, which it was today. I think the result was the only key to it. There weren't too many chances, were there? Both teams were quite tight. So, didn't it? A little bit of nerves in the first half? Yeah, a little bit of nerves in the first half, slow start. Um, but as we got settled in, you know, we was able to try and you know, get in behind them and, you know, see a Diego got in, in, in the box and you know, a bit, bit, bit of skill from him. He does it all, all the time in training. So, you know, I seen him line the defender up, I knew what was coming, so I was able to make that run and you know, he made the goal, to be honest. Did you do some finish from yourself though, outside the boot, around the corner? Yeah, yeah, I got into that position last home game and was able to open my foot up, but I didn't feel like, feel like I had time to, so I just had to try and think it from outside of, outside of the foot, and you know, I was happy with the finish and happy with it. How hard was it in the second half, desperately trying to get that second just to give you that breathing room, and obviously Bolton were trying to throw men forward and, and equalise it? Yeah, I felt we, we could have got that second. I felt, you know, going into half time, there was to be more opportunities, and you know, they're fighting for the life, they need a point, so we felt that like they would have come and leave gap, which, which they did. Um, had a couple of opportunities, me and myself at the end there. Um, Great, great pick of skill by uh, John Terrell and you know I tried to love the keeper it's probably looking back I probably should have tried and slot it away um, but you know it, it was it, it was a scrappy game um, probably a one 0 game overall and I think you know in those this time of the this time of the season you know those those results are uh, uh, you know a, a great a great this time of the season for for, for Birmingham. You know? Yeah, it's not about performances, it's just about putting points on the board and putting pressure on those teams in the playoffs. That's it, that's all it is now. Uh, coming to the crunch now, I don't know what is the 13 games or something left now, so you know, everyone's fighting now, everyone's fighting for their lives, the table's kind of fizzled out and you know you, you can see where everyone's um, are looking to finish now. And you know, like I say, you know, today was a great, great Big, big game for us to, to, to get back to winning ways and keeping keeping the mix now. I think that's what it's all about now towards the end of the season. And finally, another big game on Saturday, over 3,000 sellout blues travelling down to QPR. Didn't get bigger than this, did they? No, like I say, we well, you know, won some last in London at Fulham. You know, there's quite a few fans there and the atmosphere was, was, was amazing. I think they helped us through. and. You know, like I said, it's another sellout again. Hopefully, we can get the same turnout and same performance, and hopefully, we can get another win.